Yeah, I feel you on that. You and Wayne seemed like y'all became real cool early on. How did that happen? Just being the youngest. Just being the youngest man and um, shit, we used to write together. You feel me? We went to um, Tanya's tutoring service together. You feel me? <laughs> right. We both slept on the, the bottom bunk on the tour bus. We used to share rooms Damn. on the tour. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we did everything together. You feel me? Like everything I'm talking about until I really just started drugging and thugging hard. Mm -hmm. Cause Wayne they used to do no drugs, no none of that. You know what I'm saying? He was strictly writing. That's mm -hmm. all he wanted to do. He had me writing. Man, he used to do a lot of back to back songs mm -hmm. because shit, he making me write. If mm -hmm. you around him, you had to write music, man. Yeah. I used to be like, man, I don't feel like writing no damn music. You feel me? But that's how he was a real studio head. Mm -hmm. The same way how he is now. Mm -hmm. He was 20 times worse than when he was young. You feel me? <laughs> and um, like Wayne just he was destined to be who he is right now. So it's it's not no shocking to me. You feel me? Like like he 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 worked for that, bro. You know what I'm talking about? I was watching a um a a concert with him in Philadelphia with the Roots today. Mm -hmm. And to see him on that stage like doing his thing 30 some year later, mm -hmm. still like holding it down, you feel me? All the thing I could think about is where it started. You know, how we used to be, you feel me? I'm proud of that dude, man. You know what I'm saying? Nobody can't take nothing away from him, bro. Like, everybody wanted to be a Lil Wayne, you know what I'm talking about, after the Hot Boys. Yeah. So, you know, he deserved that spot, bro, and I don't think it'll never be another one of him. He never did drugs? At the time, he wasn't doing oh, nothing. Wow. You know That's what I'm saying? Crazy. At the time, now, Wayne wasn't, Wayne wasn't doing nothing. Man, Wayne, at the time, man, Wayne used to... um. Like the um take what it is, the damn robot tussin to go to sleep. That's it. But it was he wasn't getting high, you feel yeah. me? But shit, I, I think he, he couldn't sleep or something, you know. He'll take that robot tussin back in the days, but it was Tylenol. No, that wasn't no drugs, you feel me? But nah, he wasn't doing nothing, man. Damn, nothing. That's, that's crazy, man. So when did you run into Manny Fresh? Once you got to the label, or you already knew him before then? Nah, I knew Manny Fresh before, but um, I got a relationship from the label. Everybody know everybody some kind of way, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? But we got relationships when we started working together, you know what I'm saying? Everybody just had they different. I had a relationship with everybody, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, I done did different things with everybody on the label, you know what I'm saying? And, um... It was all cool, bro. Like, we all, you know, we was a big family, man. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, and, yeah. you know, I, I, I think now with with the social media and stuff, you know, how we, we all then came back and we didn't reconcile, even though we had a lot of different ups and downs, you know what I'm saying? It's all coming back together. Like, mm -hmm. like we remembering how it was, you feel me? Yeah. We've been doing less shows here and there. You know what I'm saying? Got a lot of things planned, up and coming right now. And um, shit, y'all just stay tuned for that. Okay. I, listen, I, I know you probably tired of this question a million times, but but are you guys reuniting for a reunion? I have to ask yeah, that question. Yeah, 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 of course. You know what I'm saying? We got, like I said, we got a lot of, a lot of stuff, man, that I don't want to like speak on right now, mm -hmm. but um, if y'all if y'all pay attention and y'all see what's going on on social media, last year we wasn't nowhere where we at now. Right. What what's going on? You mm -hmm. feel me? But um, now that time have changed. You yeah, know what I'm right, saying? Right. And things then came like it came, man. And everybody just realized, bro. I, I I I think we had conversations. You know, some of us we got on the phone with each other, mm. and we realized that it what was the problem wasn't no problem, you know what I'm saying? Right. It was a lot of misunderstanding. Me, you know, as as holding myself accountable, I probably spoke on a lot of things <clears throat> that people probably ain't wanna want people to know about at the time, you know right. what I'm saying? Like me, man, I'm an open book. Mm -hmm. But I realized as I got older and, and as I had conversations that some things is not for everybody. People wanna tell their own stories, right, you know right, what I'm right, saying? Right. So other than that, man, like, shit, it's business, you know what I'm talking about? Back to it.